Hello everybody, Georgie Burns here. Today I'd like to show you how I made this card. I had to bring this card back in. Can't do a Christmas card without Mr Snowy. So that being said, I'll be using Mr Snowy. He is a penny black stamp. Uh, yeah, penny black. I think that's Canada. Barclay, Canada. It's snowy. So that's Mr. Snowy as I call him. I'll also be using this retired stamp set. This retired last year. Night in Bethlehem. And I'm going to be using the stars here. For the cards I've got a card blank of eight and a quarter by five and seven eighths. Scored at one and four. Four and one eight. God, I forgot what it was then. Burnished. Um, piece of knight and navy at five and five eighths by three and seven eighths. A piece of white oh, that I haven't cut down. That should be three and a quarter by five and a half. I'll cut that down in a minute. And this one is five and five eighths by three and seven eighths for the inside. I've also got a piece inch, is it an inch? Oh no, three quarters of an inch. Piece of Knight and Navy, which have already embossed the word Merry Christmas on. I did this when I did this one. So I'll be using that. Let me just trim this down. <clears throat> and that will go on there nicely. So this is a relatively flat card apart from the sentiment. So what we're going to do, did I do anything inside? Oh, a star of wonder, star of night. That is also not out of there. Hmm. Don't know where I got that one from. Star of light, that's where I got that from. I'll have to do that afterwards. So, the inside I will pop that in afterwards. This is, make sure I've got the right piece. Yeah, the front. And we are going to stamp Mr. Snowy on it. I'm just going to pop him, where did I pop him, down here a bit, in the middle, and down he goes. Glitter everywhere, I don't know why. Haven't done anything with glitter today. But there's glitter. Right. Now then I'm going to use Seaside Spray, one of the new ink colours. And what we're going to do is just stamp. Let's get some scrap. We're going to stamp stars all over Ooh. the page. Try not to over stamp burns. I 
overstamp there. Don't know if my rubber will get that off. Let's see. really so I am going to stamp on it. Yay! That'll do. with that so on clean stamp all right so open this up now with my brush this brush I am going to go around the edges so all I'm doing is picking up the ink and just going around the edge with my brush and blending in a bit of the soft sea spray Going over the corners a bit extra. Oh, got an itchy nose. I'm either going to have a surprise or an argument. nicely to clean my brush all I do is get my cloth and just rub it lightly on the cloth and that will get off any colour that's on it but I do have four of them one for reds, one for greens, one for browns and one for blues. It just means I can use it on any colour blue as long as I clean it. Right, colour this in. We're going to use balmy blue light I think it was I used. No, it's not balmy blue. It is... That's balmy blue. So this one must be soft sea spray. No, it's seaside spray. I'd get it right. And we just colour his scarf in. I'm not doing it straight up and down. I'm going in like C's. Just to give it um, when it dries, hopefully it will dry with a little bit dark and a little bit light. Just so it looks like it's been knitted. I 
and some of this hat. That's all the colouring, believe it or not. Unless you count colouring in with the Winker Stella. Oh no, no, I did do black. Come on, Burns, do it properly. His lumps of coal. I coloured in black. I gave him an orange nose. And some pink cheeks. Then I went ooh, over it with the Wink of Stella, which has got loads in it. But I only went over the white in the Winker Stella. I smell the alcohol in this pen. Let's do his face. I don't know if you can see that, but he's really glittery. You might be able to catch it there. But trust me, he is glittery. So, I'll just put this card together. This is just a quick and easy card you wouldn't mind making multiples of The inside I will do off camera, so pretend I've done that. Now, this will chop there, preferably straight, and flag it out. And for some unknown reason, looks like I went on the cut it on my trimmer, 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 and I've used the other side. That's all right. Sorted. Um. 
it's not it's not very straight let's cut a bit off that's better and we'll get some dimensionals that's the little ones what big ones have we got left huh? Use them. Take the backings off and stick this there. And there we have it. A glittery Christmas card. I wish you could see the glitter on that. I don't think you can. Or you might do it at the bottom there. But yes. I hope you like it. If you do, give us a thumbs up. If you'd like to see more of my videos, please subscribe. And, um... If you press the bell icon, you'll be notified of any more videos I upload, which is usually on Monday, Wednesday and Friday. All I can say is thanks for visiting, and I hope to see you again soon.